Hi everybody, um, I've got this weekend's car boot sale haul and Gumtree haul for you and an auction haul for you as well. So it could be quite a long video. Um, it's going to be a bit of a mixed bag of lot. Um, in my other videos, I've shown you at my car boot sale, they do a filler bag for either a pound or filler bag for either three pound or two bags or a fiver. So... That is this first lot here, you can see. This is all fill a bag for a fiver. So I'm going to show you that first. Then I'm going to show you as well what we got from the car boot sale over here. They were single items. And then here, this was all stuff that at the end of the car boot sale, when it was closing, there was three stalls decided to just give away stuff that they had on their store. So we had a quick look and picked off stuff that would go with some that we already had or would make up other bundles or we could sell singly so i'll show you that as well uh, i also put a video on that i we picked up a gum tree haul on friday um and it was massive it took up the whole of the dining room it took us about three hours to sort out and so i'll show you the stuff that i picked out of there that was good. Uh, I'll also show you if I've got time on the end of the video the auction haul that I've just picked up. It's a massive toy Fisher Price kind of haul. Um, for nine, I got that all for nine pounds. So I'll show you that. Um, I just watched it online and then I bid online and then I went and picked it up today. So I hadn't got a chance to have a look what was actually inside the box. So that's the look of the draw with auctions anyway. Um, but So I'll start with the first lot and then I'll flip over to the next lot and then I'll keep flipping over so you haven't got a massive lot to see. Right, I'll start with the first lot. This was our filler bag for, normally it's filler bag for £3, but the guy said, do you want, want to do two bags for £5? So I thought, why not? Because there was some really good bulky items and some good stuff in there. So I thought, okay, why not? And then, so that's what we did. Aaron loves doing this. He loves rummaging, having a good rummage through the boxes and seeing what he can find. And this time we've come up with some good stuff. Right, so I'll start at this end. First of all, there was this Fireman Sam helicopter that I spotted. But when I got home, I realised, unless it's in the car, there's a blade missing on the, the helicopter. A bit disappointed, but never mind. I've got a few Fireman Sam figures to go over this as well. Um, Aaron spotted this Playmobil police prison wagon so we've got that uh to go with another police bundle that we've got going uh we've seen this ty beanies it's quite cute it's got easter eggs on i thought coming up to easter some of my purchases to go in a hamper or something like that maybe so i'll put that on some of the stuff that we've looked what well, we've got here today i haven't looked at any prices some i have vaguely um quickly when i came home um and some i haven't so i just basically picked it up and blind really um i found these learn to drive dvds three dvds in there cds pc dvd whatever they're called <clears throat> i'll either try them on ebay or when i get the chance to go on amazon because i'm not on amazon fba yet um i'll pop them on there then i found these two guys quite chunky and i know they are a tv program possibly on cbb's not quite sure but for the life of me, I cannot think what they're off. So if anybody knows, I would be happy if you could pop it in the comments what program these are from. I just picked them up because I thought they're quite, quite chunky and they're quite good. And I'm sure there'll be some girls I can pick up to go with that. Um, Scooby-Doo figures. I love to pick up the Scooby-Doo stuff because I've got Scooby-Doo wagons and things like that. Houses to go with that. So we've got three Scooby-Doo figures. Skylanders. I've seen these in the box. I thought I'd pick them up. Again, they can go with a job lot of stuff. Um, I've sold a VTEC camera before last year, a blue one. Um, so I spotted this pink one, so I thought I'll have a try with that. Um, again, Skylanders Portal. Picked that up. I had to unravel 100 wires to get this, but I thought I'm having that. So that's that. Uh, this Elemis Mega Bag. Absolutely gorgeous inside. Uh, no doubt the daughter will claim that. Uh, one of these GML hover balls. I could kick myself because there was two. But Aaron just picked up the one. But then when we went back for it, it had already gone. Um, speed stacks with the cups in. No amount of timer, which is a bit disappointing. Uh, coffee, sugar and tea jars. I thought they were really pretty. If they don't sell, I'll have them myself. Um, sorry if I'm going too fast. Um, this Donick... 
Ch oh, I can't even pronounce that. I'm not even going to try in case I offend. Um, ping pong bat, is that what you call it? A ping pong bat paddle. It's in absolutely great condition. There's no chips out of it or anything. It comes with ping pongs in the back. Um, so, yeah, and the bag's in great condition. But, yeah, so it's a classic Donick ping pong bat. So, I have looked at this on eBay, and there's not many of these on. Um, so, I'll have to do a little bit more research and see what these are kind of going for. Uh, we picked up two wees. Um, with the leads, um, we need to clip these back on. I have really good luck with wheeze, and um, they seem to go quite quickly when I put them on. So, always pick them up for cheap if I see them. So, all of this here was five pounds, which I thought was quite a good bargain. Um, even if I make five pounds just on the way, I'm pleased with that. Um, so that is my filler bag, first and foremost. Now, I'll show you what we picked up on the individual stalls. So give me two seconds, I'll flip that over. Right, so this is the lot that we just picked up on individual stores as we went round. We picked up these adjustable quad skates. Um, they were a pound still in the box. Box is a little bit bad, but the skates are in really good condition. Um, we got all of these Nerf stuff for three pound, including the glasses, safety goggles. And this was 50 pence, another portal, and the Scooby-Doo Mystery Machine, 50 pence. Again, I pick them up all the time because they're cheap enough and they can make lots. So that's that bundle. I'm now going to show you my great bundle of free stuff. Right, now, this is our free stuff. This is what people were just giving away on off their stores. Um, I've seen this in the box, instantly seen Disney and this is the official Disney Paris Minnie Mouse ears love them glittery uh, I've checked out these and these are going from anything from about five to twenty pound absolutely mad yep so that's that Mr. Potato Head again all of this was free um Fifi and the flower tops if I'm not pa flower pots maybe if I'm not mistaken interactive speaks um, these all need the, probably a little wash, wash as well. Uh, Zingzillas, I think these are. So, yep, yeah, another Fifi. Another talking Fifi. Uh, SpongeBob pillow. I think I may claim this one. Um, Scout the VTech leap pad, leap frog, whatever it's called. <laughs> get it right, get it right. <clears throat> leap frog. There we go, Leaf Frog, my pal Scout. Yep, so again, he's a bit grubby and he needs a bit of a wash. Um, Vans, baseball boots, again, I've checked, they are really grubby. I've checked these out and these can go for about £20, so not bad for free. They've got like a bit of fur inside. Um, Aaron picked this up, I thought it was to beat you at first, so I thought I could have just sold the cloth, but it's not. So I'll have to do a little bit of research and see if I can do something with that. Um, I've got a flow on at the minute uh, so I picked up this pink mother care one I'm not sure what they'll do I've got a flow on at the minute um, but I don't know who knows coming up the summertime um, just a little bucket of dolls some more things the last stuff the more Fifi stuff and some animals <clears throat> so that kindly was all the free stuff that people were giving away now to show you the lot that we got from Gumtree. Right, sorry I'm making this video extra long, but I would like to show you everything that I got anyway, so just to get it all out. Right, so this is the Gumtree bundle that we picked up on Friday. Like I said, it took over the whole of the dining room. It took us about three hours to sort out. So now what was rubbish, what needed to go on eBay, what needed to go to the charity shop, call would say what the lot. So this is what we picked out just a few things that we picked out to put on eBay. We got this trailer, brand new trailer hitch lock. Um, no idea. Uh, Michael's Googled this on eBay, so this can go for some money. So he says, so he tells me, so that's kept being kept out. Um, this gorgeous River Island sparkly bag, really good inside. 
Um, this is a fondue set with all the forks and things. Stainless steel fondue set. I need to take it out of the bag and sort it out and stuff like that. The box, sorry. Um, kitchen science. I've sold one of these before for nine ninety nine. So I'll pitch for that for that one as well. Pity it wasn't near Christmas. Um, this is a baby move sort of blanket. I think they lie on it. it stops them rolling over. So they're on eBay. So I'm gonna pop that on. Um, a jig jigrography. Um, got one of them again, brand new inside. That's gonna go on for about nine ninety nine. Sorry, I'm just gonna move out of the way. Um, Harry Potter. Philosopher's Stone Mystery at Hogwarts game. So yeah, so that's going on. Backgammon and drafts. We can get about forty ninety nine for that. There and thereabouts. And in very old vintage style. Othello. And I do again have a lot of luck with Othello. So that'll be going on. Also, a pair of brand new roller blades. They're the ones in the box. So got them. Two baby carriers, one's from Mother Care and one's Baby Bjorn. So got them. Um, I also and there's an early learning truck there. Also got this winter warmer single electric blan blanket. Now I'm not sure whether to put this on eBay or not. Comment down below if anybody has any luck with electric blankets. Big bl sorry, blankets. Sorry, um, can't speak. Um, because I'm not sure. Whether to put this on eBay or not, it's one of them things where I'm just not sure what to do with that. But if people have luck with them, I'm going to put them on. Um, so that's that. And then for pan round, this black bag is full of girl shoes. There's necks, there's monsoon, there's sandals, tap shoes, leotards. There's another bag in there. Just a new look one. Some bunting, gorgeous in there there's like I see sandals there's clothes there's dresses so they're all gonna go on either there's coat and a coat there um sandals for the summer for having said that uh, and these kind of boots for children big sort of trekking boots ski boots if you like um so little tap shoes so yeah so I'm gonna put all them on little next boots um, and that's that was a gum just some of the gum tree bundle that I've shown you. Um, there's other bits and bobs. There's some vintage glasses, um, a German beer glass which I've sold before, and other bits and bobs. I'll quickly pan around. Like I say, excuse the mess of the dino. I've just pulled everything out. Um, this is the stuff I've just literally picked up from the auction. I paid nine pound for this box. Um, there's this doll, uh, Sally doll. I've sold one of these before with loads of clothes. Um, she's got very straggly hair. So I'm going to take Sue piles, Sue's piles of shame tip and do the old softener on the hair conditioner. <coughs> Sorry, technique. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, and there's also a stain on her dress. So I'm going to try and get that off. Sorry about that. I had a bit of a cotton fit. And they're in the boxes like these sort of toys, VTEC, there's a castle, like a Fisher Price aeroplane, VTEC stuff in there, <clears throat> and it's like this sort of stuff, and I have to sort all, <clears throat> so I have to sort all of this out, sorry about that everybody, I'm a bit of a coughing fit there, this sore throat is going on too long, um, so yeah, I have to just sort it out and just see what I've got, and pile it up and see what's there and what's not there. so thanks for watching don't forget to give me a thumbs up and like and subscribe bye for now